T minus 10 seconds. Solid motor igniters are armed. Four, three, two, one, zero, and lift off. Over 30 years ago, the first Eurostar satellite was launched. Inmarsat 2F1 was designed to operate for 10 years and eventually took its retirement 22 years later. Since the very beginning of the family, reliability has been at the heart of the Eurostar product line. In the 90s and the early 2000s, the market was shaping around various usages – TV, radio, data, secure communications, internet, phone, video, maritime mobility. Both professional and non-professional customers were asking for more connectivity. At the dawn of this new century, once the market stabilized, customers kept asking for more throughput, leading to several innovations on the Eurostar platform. Airbus has been working hard for the last 30 years to always meet their needs, adopting a constant innovative approach. The Eurostar platform has evolved massively, going from the first E1000 to the E2000 Plus in only six years, doubling its payload mass and tripling its payload power. We have liftoff of a proton rocket from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. In 2004, the new E3000 allowed for a wider range of launchers, thus giving customers more flexibility. New propulsion types were proposed, first with hybrid propulsion, combining electrical and chemical fuel for orbit raising and station keeping, then with full electric propulsion, reducing propellant mass and allowing heavier and more powerful payloads, or the reduction of the satellite's launch mass. In 2017, Airbus delivered the world's first high-power all-electric telecom satellite, UTELSAT 172B. In a fast-moving, ever-changing world, telecom satellites have become smarter and more flexible, optimizing radio frequency resources. In 2018, Airbus delivered SES-12, the most powerful telecom satellite ever built until then. Over time, user applications and connectivity needs have constantly grown, requiring higher throughput, more data, more TV channels and ever higher image definition. To meet these demands, Airbus has developed a solid expertise and is one of the world's leading SATCOM manufacturers. Airbus has gained the trust of a customer base from all over the world. The Eurostar lineage is an extremely rich heritage for Airbus and it is this experience that allows us to begin a new stage in the Eurostar story today. Eurostar NEO